Turn me up a little bit. Hey, what it do, Star Gang Ace? Your boy, your favorite pit master's favorite pit master, and I'm back. May 26th. Netflix. Check out my boy Thyron from TNT Barbecue. He gonna be on there. He gonna be doing a damn thing. Check him out. You see, I'm sporting my TNT Barbecue T-shirt today. And number two is what I'm cooking today. What I'm cooking today, I'm doing some some leg quarters on the pit barrel cooker. No salt. Only thing I'm seasoning this bad boy with is some Mrs. Dash. I'm gonna see if I can get kind of creative. All right, Star Gang, you guys come on along with me. We about to do the damn thing with these leg quarters. All right, see what you got right here? You got that knuckle. I like to break that joint right between the back and that thigh and get rid of it. Cause uh, to be quite honest, I think uh, the presentation is better without the back. So, come okay, and do another one. Just break that socket, boom, cut it. And now you got your backs done. This is what you're left with. You know what I'm saying? You can choose to cook these. I don't like to cook the chicken back. You're losing a little bit of meat. But you can save these for stock or what have you. Me personally, I'm going to get rid of them. Hey, remember when you're working with poultry, always keep your countertops and stuff clean. I use the bleach to clean mine. All right, I'm going over this Mrs. Dash. Uh, it's the chicken blend. Uh, never used it. It's going to be the first time for both of us, but it's supposed to be salt free. And what do I do like about this being a salt freeze is that it doesn't really matter how heavy you go on with it because you're not going to overpower it with salt. So let's get into it. Let me see how she sprinkles out like this. First. We're going for flavor. No salt, just flavor. And another thing why I chose to do it on the, on the smoker too, because that smoke is going to add up a little bit of flavor to it. It's gonna have its own element of flavor. So, we're trying to get around a, not missing this salt. Would that be some meat stall putting out healthy barbecue? It is 2023, but let's keep shaking this thing on here. Off to the pit barrel. We're gonna be cooking on the grate today. We're gonna see if I can get 10 leg quarters on this grate. I might not be able to, but we are actually gonna try. I'm gonna take about a quarter of these out. Put them in here. Once these get lit up, I'm gonna take this and I'm gonna throw it right in there. I'm gonna use some of these uh, biomass fire starters. All right, we're gonna sit this on here. We're probably gonna wait about 15 minutes and should be ready to rock. So I'm just gonna put these on here, right here, like this. And I'll take it spread around a little bit. A little skeet, uh, I think a mesquite right here in the middle. Now let's see if we can get 10 leg quarters on one on one rack. I'm damn sure gonna try. We on there. I anticipate this cook probably being about two hours, but uh, we put the top on it. Let's get it. Oh, it's been exactly one hour. Let's open this bad boy and see what she looking like. And see what we got. She looking pretty good. Got a nice color. I like the color on these bad boys. I'm not gonna mop these. Thighs are kind of forgiving, so. We'll come out here probably about another hour. Then I'm gonna check it, see what we got. All right, we probably like about an hour 45. Let's go ahead and uh, 
tip these bad boys out. They look at the basil. Let's turn them over and see how they looked on the skin side. We got the it's a little crispy, but uh, not burnt by any means. Yeah, these are these are done. We're gonna go ahead and get these off and uh, put them up. Looking pretty good. I like. I can say I'm impressed by the way it cooked and it got crispy skin. Look at those. Uh, that's how barbecue chicken supposed to look. All right, Star Gang, what's going on? It's nighttime now. I've tasted the, the uh, leg quarters, and for me, I have to say that uh, <laughs> Mrs. Dash uh, low sodium is a no. Uh, I was hoping with the onions and garlics and herbs that I could get around. It just tasted bland to me. Even the skin. Uh, it just was bland. It, it didn't have any flavor. Um, at first, I wasn't even going to do a video. I was just going to scrap the material that I had. But then I was like, hey, you might as well put it out because uh, people need to know that everything doesn't come out great or come out grand or whatever. Hey, if I had to say th this one, a thumbs up or a thumbs down, to me, it's a thumbs down. Now, you can always use it up. You know what I'm saying? But you can add different things or sauces or whatever. But I wanted the meat to stand out for itself. And to me, to be quite honest, it did. All right, well, Star Gang, it's the Meat Star. Find you some meat and smoke it. Okay. Turn me up a little bit.